what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel i'm jason with jcs reefing and in this video we are going to open up the bashi pro series sump this one particularly is 36 by 18 by 16 inches tall so let's get it out of the box and take a look Once I got this sump out of the box, the first thing I did was take a quick look over, make sure there's no imperfections or cracks in the acrylic. Um, and I will say shout out to this company because this is fantastically packed. Um, they put a protectant over all of your acrylic. I peeled off some of it here. But you can see it's real easy to come off. No big deal. You just kind of peel this away and it comes right off. Um, and also that all the edges are beveled. So you get no sharp corners. Everything is really, really, really smooth. Um, no sharp edges. And the biggest thing for me, this, this particular one is 36 inches long, 18 inches deep, um, and 16 inches tall. Now I love the 18 inch front to back um, simply because there's not a lot of sumps out there that mass produce um, sumps unless you go custom that have a good depth. Now the depth for me, personally is a big thing because it makes it a lot easier to get uh, skimmers and reactors or whatever else you might want to use in here in and out so you can kind of angle stuff to get it in and out a lot easier with that depth now this sump is the pro series and they do make a, a bunch of other ones um, but this one will accommodate the reef mat or red sea the clarity sk 3000 5000 and probably 90 to 99 percent of all your filtration uh, filter rollers out there on the market today and then it also comes with adjustable baffle uh, adjustable baffles so right here you're going to see two knobs the baffles are actually in this which will open up here shortly and once we get all of the um, protectant peeled away we will uh, go through pretty much what it looks like when it's all 100 percent opened up now once everything is opened up you can kind of see that this build is top notch um, you do have your baffles in here that you can adjust um, height up and down simply by sliding this and then tightening these screws right here so if you wanted it um, higher or lower you can do that you also have another baffle on this side of the sump as well before it goes to the return you could also take this out. You could put media down here in bags if you want to, but it also gives you a bunch of space to add not just the return pump, but also a media reactor back here. You have multiple spots to put a uh, dosing line. So you have one in your return section. You have some right here. You have some right here. And then you also have your four probes with um, rubber grommets to hold the probes in place. Now, as far as the sump itself, um, you have two drains, one inch, and then you also have these that you could use for liquid level sensors from Apex if you wanted to. You could also maybe probably put bulkheads in here for a third drain or, you know, coming up a return, a UV. Um, it's just very versatile uh, on what you can do with this sump. So overall, I cannot be happier uh, with this purchase. Um, because everything is just so so clean down to like I was saying the beveled edges which nothing is sharp edges um, everything is super super smooth and yeah pretty pumped to get this on the tank itself um, if you have any questions I do believe that this does come in a uh, this is the 36 I believe it does come in a 48 as well as a 60 inch sump and as far as I know, Bashi, if you reach out to them, they will um, probably customize and do kind of whatever you want to do. Um, of course, you know, added cost could be to that. This is one of their main product lines. Um, but yeah, I cannot be happier with this sump. There is no doubt that um, the build quality of this is top notch and they've really thought of everything on this pro series line as far as uh, versatility and you know what you want to do with the sump um, reef mat skimmer fugium skimmer skimmer fugium however you want to basically do this sump you can do it so reach out to them definitely um, 
have no uh, no regrets buying this thing because I am extremely excited. Now if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do so and also hit that notification bell as this whole build will be taking place and one step at a time. So like, comment, subscribe and happy roofing. Cheers.